Today is World Oceans Day, meant to raise global awareness of the benefits we get from the ocean and the duty we have to use its resources sustainably. In this Earth 8 report, our Brian White gives us an inside look at the city of San Diego's ocean monitoring program and the work they're doing to protect one of our most precious natural resources. I'm here at the city of San Diego's Ocean Monitoring Lab, where they're doing important work to monitor the health of our coastal waters. Marine biologists collecting samples of sea life to better understand the different species in our ocean. We want to see the diversity of populations out in the local coastal waters so that we can get a better sense on how local impacts might be affecting their movement and the specific uh, arrangement of those different species. Typically, most of these animals are immediately returned to the ocean after being identified by researchers, but many of the smaller microscopic organisms collected in the sediment can take weeks, if not months, to identify. They actually need to be brought back to the laboratory to be identified by specialist taxonomies here in the lab. And so using the microscope setups like you see here, they'll actually be able to look at these animals under the microscope and decipher very specific, minute details about those animals to be able to separate the species. Ryan Kempster is a marine biologist for the city's ocean monitoring program. The team serves a very specific purpose. Because the city owns and operates wastewater facilities. Our program really exists to make sure that the treated wastewater that is discharged by the ocean outfalls is not having a negative impact on ocean water quality and the environment and ecosystem that the animals live within. Monitoring the quality of our ocean water is no easy job, and they have some tools to help out. So this is our water profile, and this allows us to assess the quality of the local coastal waters by actually collecting water samples at various depths throughout the water column. And with this device, known as an ROV, or remotely operated vehicle, they're able to survey the sea floor and check to make sure any pipes carrying water from the treatment facilities are functioning properly without any leaks. San Diego coastal waters are actually very healthy and very good condition, which is great. But by assessing the whole region, we can also look more broadly at larger indicators of changes in ocean health, whether that be from climate change or specific events or other sources of pollution throughout the region. In San Diego, I'm Brian White for CBS 8.